Hi guys, I'm Laura Madden. Welcome to the live happy hour art tour. Um, tonight we're talking about refashioned art. And yes, we have a, a second star of the show and a third star of the show. Um, Rescue Dogs, we might as well introduce the, the mini stars. Blanca, Poodle Mix, Luce, Schnorky, and these are both rescues, adopt, don't shop, guys. If you're getting a dog, adopt, don't shop. Examples here. So, refashioned art. Welcome to the happy hour art tour. This is week five, right? Ed? Week yes. five, right? Week five. And um, we're having fun. And so I want to thank you for joining me. And I want to thank you guys for the questions and the feedback. Um, we're going to see some art tonight. Um, anyone who follows me on my art page at Refashioned Art is where I share all of my art. If you're not familiar with Refashioned Art, everything, all our originals, everything is for. <laughs> Do I have a comment? No. Heidi's here just for the bloopers. <laughs> Stop it. Heidi, I know where you're getting at. There's going to be no giggle. There's going to be none of that tonight. <laughs> so. Uh, where was I? Totally lost my train of thought. Refresh and art, all originals, all are for sale. Anyone out there needs art, you better DM me. And everything is repurposed, made of repurposed materials. So, I think it's pretty special because this is our merging of style and sustainability and I believe it is the future. Circularity, we're keeping things out of landfill, reducing waste, and I hope you're here for it. I hope you're here for it because sustainability is a really big topic. So everything you're going to see here tonight is for sale. I have a lot of pieces that are completed for sale, ready to go. So if you're in need of something, just DM me, let me know what you're looking for. Everything I do is abstract. So if that's your style, then chances are good, maybe I have something for you. I don't know. So before we get into the art, I want to talk about my dress. The dress. The dress. OMG, this dress. My good friend, Crystal Daniels, she is a designer reseller. She found this dress for me shopping. And this is like the dress, the dress that I have been dreaming about since I was like five years old. This is like the Barbie dress that I always, always, always wanted. And she found it. So vintage dress, it actually has a tag that says international women's um, garment workers union. So this is like old, old, old. And I think it's amazing that the quality is so good, this dress is still here. I mean, it's just like so fabulous. It feels so fabulous. So I hope you love it as much as I do. Thank you, Crystal. Um, I don't know, I just, I feel like an absolute Barbie. I don't know. I love this dress. It is the best. So let's get on to the art. My cameraman is prompting me on. So I guess we'll, I guess it's time to move on from the dress. Thank you, Crystal. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I love it. And I'm here with uh, Mom Sparkling Wine Napa Maid. So I've got my golden bubbles and I've got my golden dress as promised. Here we go. All right. So the first pieces that I want to talk about are these right here. Now we did see this one here last week. It wasn't quite finished yet. Um, I did another one that I thought was actually a good match. Now this is replay one. This is called replay. Now I put them up, I wanted to display them like this for you because I really like how these go together. They don't have to go together, but I think they look really good together. And if anybody watched my live art demo that I did earlier today, I talked a little bit how much I love um, putting together a series of work. You know, we've got two here together that go together. I just think it gives more of an impact. It gives a little more drama to your decor. So I love these. These are repurposed frames, vintage frames. I actually painted them gold. And um, I'm just loving the black and white. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I know she's cute, but so replay one, uh, replay 
These are both for sale, uh, roughly 20 by 24. This one obviously is just a little bit larger. Honey, how is the lighting here? Are you able to get, the light's a little funky because we have these skylights. Um, but I really like those, I don't know, I'm contemplating not selling them, but for the time being, those are for sale. Um, so the next series we have here, so again, we have a series of three. These obviously are not exactly the same. Everything I do is original, so they'll never be an exact replica. Nothing is, oh, excuse me, sweetie, thank you. Uh, nothing is ever exactly the same, but I made these all to look similar. I made these all to look like they go together. So if you need a series of three, you have a series of three, but of course at the same time, these could all go alone. You know, they could go on their own. I also think these would be fabulous in a frame, either a gold frame or a white thin, like a floater frame, I think would be very cool. You could do a navy frame, but um, I do think a frame would finish these really well. These are called Trailblazer 1, Trailblazer 2, Trailblazer 3. These are all 16 by 16 inch square canvases, and these are $75 each. $75 each. And then on the replays, replay one and replay, these are both $150 each. Um, this one here is just a tad larger, just a tad. So we've got these, gold and black. Tonight kind of like the theme is gold because the dress, just couldn't help myself. And then we've got the three trailblazers. Again, kind of cool, just gives a little bit of flair. I love the little touch of gold. And of course I love blue, love blue and white. So, um, you know, I think it's pretty transitional, obviously modern art, it's abstract, but I do, um, I do think it could go with a number of like different types of decor. So I think we're gonna go this way next. Okay, you with me? Yes. Okay, yes? Okay. Okay, so this one here is called Big Bold. I really love this one. Um, I've never actually had it displayed before, and now that I see it on the wall, I'm contemplating also keeping this one, but for the time being, this one is for sale. Again, this is Big Bold. Uh, this was, this is actually a wood panel. And I love just the feel of a wood panel. It's just like a little bit different. I love the depth. It's a little bit thicker than you'd get with a, you know, your standard canvas. I don't know, I mean, it's well over an inch. But um, I love, again, black and white. I just love that bold impact of the black and white, and it's called Big Bold. This is 18 inches by 18 inches square canvas, and um, this one is $250, and for the time being, it's for sale. Any questions, guys? If you have questions, please don't be shy. Um, People my, love the dress. My cameraman, I love the dress too. It's all crystal, designer treasure hunt, guys. I mean, she found this. I don't know how, she's like a magnet. So you gotta, you gotta look up Designer Treasure Hunt. I mean, it's just, yeah, dying, dying, love it. Okay, so this one here, guys, um, if anybody's been watching my live demos um, or following Refashioned Art, I was talking a little bit about this canvas. I, I also have shared that in my studio, I do not have air conditioning. And today was well over 100 when I did my uh, live art demo. I think it was like 104, 105 or something. So I did this one, uh, I did this one in two phases and I was out yesterday morning, like it was like 5.40 in the morning, which is when I really have to go out there because it's cool enough. And um, it was one of those things that just kind of came to me. My husband calls it Snoopy. Oops. Oh, um, my husband has named this Snoopy. I have named it Pivot Bounce because it's kind of like the theme of the time, Pivot and Bounce. So for now, this is called Pivot Bounce. This is 51 inches by 51 inches, so it's a really good size. I would love to keep this here. Again, black and white is my thing. I love it. I love the boldness of it. But usually a table goes here in another piece of art goes here. So unfortunately, this one is for sale for now. Um, it's not priced yet. Again, I just I just finished it. And if you if you were watching uh, any of my stories or the art demo, this was the canvas that I actually found in a neighbor's trash. A neighbor was throwing this out. I, I asked first, I knocked on her door, 
and I asked, you know, are you sure you're getting rid of this? And she had no use for it. It was on her driveway. So guys, no shame in the game, which is reducing waste and, you know, doing what we can to conserve resources. Any little bit that you can repurpose and reuse things that already exist, every bit counts. Every bit counts. So I really want to encourage everybody, repurpose as much as you can because this beautiful canvas was going straight to the trash. I mean, literally, it was going straight to landfill because someone else, its original owner, had no use for it, which I feel very lucky now it's here. So guys, this one is available. Again, great size if you have a large wall. I think it's great with a minimalist decor. I think it's great with a more modern decor, contemporary decor. Um, so if you're interested, DM me, let me know. Moving on, moving on. So guys, if you have questions, you can put it, you can use that little question mark button. Um, <laughs> what is everyone else drinking out there? No drinking. No drinking. <laughs> Ed, that's not true. I mean, come on. Ed. Okay, so I know you're trying to make me laugh because I'm not going to come tonight. Do not do that. So we saw this one last week, just taking one more pass through in Lady Liberté. I'm really loving this one, and I'm actually really loving this one here. My husband really loves this one here. It's not quite the right scale. I wish it was just a little bit wider. For this space. Um, I don't know, I could reframe it. I could, but for the time being, this one is for sale. Um, but it is a pretty good size, but not quite what I'm looking for. Not quite the right scale. So, all right. Yeah, you can um, zoom in on that if you'd like. And that one actually was 100% um, spray paint. I used only spray paint on that one. Many layers of spray paint. There were many uh, variations of that, but that one is for sure done. Lady Liberté. Um, we saw this one, uh, Bijou Rouge. That one's not for sale. I really love that one. And so, um, just a few more guys. How are we on time, cameraman? Uh, 17 minutes. Mm. Oh, already? Okay. Okay. Are you getting bored? I feel. No, people, people are very excited. You're very bored. People are very bored? Okay. No, people are excited. All right, well, we'll move on then. Okay, so just a few more I want to show, guys. And the purpose of me doing this, besides, like, utterly being, you know, self-entertainment, to be quite honest about that, um, I really, you know, with this time where so many events are canceled that I would maybe be part of, I really need an outlet to market my art, to show my art, and I do have a lot of art that needs to be sold so I can keep creating more art. So thank you guys for joining. Um, this is just one of those ways that I think is creative and somewhat fun, and at least I get to dress up and drink a cocktail um, and maybe sell some art. We'll see, you let me know if you want any of these pieces. So this one here is Trust Light. I love, love, love this one. Again, vintage frame, vintage gold frame. I love, and this is like the bamboo, which is so like, you know, I don't know, Palm Beach, like 60s. Um, and then a piece of modern art inside this old frame. Again, I love that juxtaposition of the old with the new, the vintage with the more modern, you know, edgier looking um, piece of art. So again, this is Trust Life. This is 20 by 24. I think this one is $150. Um, I love this one. I would love to keep it at the moment. I really don't have a space for it, which is such a bummer. Um, but if anyone's interested in it, please DM me. Um, very bright, but it definitely I wanted to go to a you know a forever home, and I really wanted to go to a stylish home. So people are asking that champagne. What are you drinking again? Uh, this is Mom's sparkling wine, Mom from Napa. It's so delicious. It really is. It's not Moe. It's not the Heidi. The Vev was top for sure. That's top. Um, but for now, I mean it's. It's very nice and smooth and light for a, a 111 degree day here in Arizona. Um, wearing my solid gold gown, it hits the spot. Hits the spot. 
And so guys, one more pass through. We saw this one last week. Um, I named this one Rock Shine Speak. Um, it just, that name came to me, I don't know, Rock Shine Speak. And this is a pretty good size. Um, I don't recall the dimensions. I think it's like uh, 40 by 50 about. But again, this one came in this frame. It's a very minimalist silver frame. And if anyone's interested in this, I don't know, I might have a wall for it, but I really have to move things around. So for the time being, this one is for sale. It doesn't look quite the same on this wall as it did on the other side of the house, but um, do love this one. If you like a touch of gold, not crazy gold like I do, then this one is for you. You know, it's a little bit more subdued, minimalist. Uh, easier on the eye as opposed to this one here which is a little bit more bold so this one here is like got the gold in subtleties this one here is a little bit more boldness with the gold um, and you know it's got the vintage ornate frame the frame was also another friend by designer treasure hunt that she found this frame for me and I put the art in the frame it came without a canvas um, but again, I love the juxtaposition, this vintage old ornate frame with this more modern minimalist art. Uh, but again, you can see the difference. Gold, we've got gold, but very minimalist gold, um, you know, subtle. And then here a lot more bold. And this one is called Presence One. And I think this one is 375, which um, I know is a really, really low price, but I really want this to go to a good home. We don't really have a spot for it right now, but I love this painting so much. Um, but yeah, so that's Presence One. And then we've got Rock Speak Shine. We've got Trust Life. If you could just pan one last time. Um, so guys, if you're interested in any of these, if you know anyone looking for art, send them my way. And let's just do one last pass through of a few of the things right here. You know, we've got replay one, replay, and then we've got the trailblazer one, two, and three. But um, so as you can see, I mean, other than the heavy and the black and white, the theme of the night was definitely gold. Um, so guys, that's really it. I know I talked a little bit longer than my cameraman had um, would have liked, but here we are, um, guys. Please just keep the conversation open. If you have questions about my process, if you have questions about upcycling and repurposing or about sustainability, <laughs> sustainability in general, please reach out to me. Um, and if you like my style and you really care about the planet, check out my website, imlauramadden.com. And again, you know, the dress, I, it sounds like it was a hit. The dress was a hit. Vintage, guys. Vintage, I think this was Goodwill but seriously vintage. I mean, this was made by the International Women's Garment Workers Union. I don't know, is that 40s? If anyone out there knows when, like what time period that was, I think it might be 40s. Please put it in the comments or DM me, I wanna know. Um, but I just love this dress. So grateful to Crystal Daniels for finding it for me. Grateful for you guys for showing up and watching, enjoying. I think it's time for us to um, proceed with our happy hour cocktails and maybe a bite to eat. So guys, wherever you are, hope you're having a good one. Hope you're having a good one and we'll see you next Friday. Bye-bye.